Okay, everybody. Um, I got time to do one more review today. Um, yesterday, I got informed that there actually was one more um, Chinese-made antivirus that I forgot to review. And uh, I went online and grabbed a copy of it. It's called uh, Kingsoft Antivirus. Uh, and installed the, uh, the trial for it. It comes with the antivirus, person personal firewall and anti-spyware. Uh, I guess that the anti-spyware is kind of like a separate part that you use it to scan with. So I installed uh, the antivirus plus and uh, it's all updated and it's just like it comes from the factory nothing's been messed with. So let's give it a test here. Um, I have some links and we'll see what we can do and uh, when I'm done with these links what I'm gonna do is not only am I gonna scan with the antivirus element I'm also gonna scan with the anti-spyware element um, hopefully those two combined will do a good job at protecting the system but you never know I have personally yet to be impressed by uh, any of the Chinese software solutions other than uh, Twister antivirus. That was the only one that impressed me, um, but it still needed some work, especially on the scanning side, because it was too slow. So let's see here. Looks like Internet Explorer found that one. So far, I don't see anything from Kingsoft. I don't see any pop-ups. I don't see anything. So I'm definitely not seeing anything here from it. I don't know if it's just blocking things silently or or what, because it's not making a peep. Windows firewall. Taskhost.exe. We'll let that go out, see if it wants to download some more uh, Trojans or anything. Well, it looks like the system's locking up here. At least the firewall part locked up. That's still downloading. That one's dead.
Alright, so I'm going to wait for these to finish downloading and I'll be right back. Okay, so what I had to do is uh, the computer locked up pretty much and um, what I did is I restarted and I went straight into safe mode and uh, it's nice that it lets you do a scan in safe mode. So I'm going to let this scan and I'll be back when it's done. See if it finds anything. Alright, so um, Kingsoft Antivirus finished scanning and it didn't find anything. So now we're going to do a scan with the antivirus. And we're going to do a malware scan. So I'll be back when that's done. See you in a second. All right, so uh, I didn't find anything. Guess it didn't take that long. I'm going to restart now. I'm going to run CCleaner and then install Malwarebytes and give that a scan. So I will be back when Malwarebytes is done scanning. All right, so um, Malwarebytes finished scanning here and it says it found seven things. So uh, yeah, you can see we definitely have some kind of worm going on here and a back door. So we will remove these. And I will do a scan with Hitman Pro and see what that finds. Be right back. Alright, and uh, Hitman Pro finished scanning and they found two, uh, two extra Trojans. So I should say that um, Kingsoft didn't really uh, do much to protect the system. There's uh, some couple of nasty infections. The worms are actually pretty bad that uh, it's infected with, and it's heavy on RAM usage, uh, mainly in the uh, antivirus service. So if they could work at getting that down, that'd be nice. But they definitely need to work at their detection ratio. Um, the firewall stopped a couple things um, by asking me when I wanted to install Malwarebytes and Hitman Pro if I wanted to give it access to the net. That's all it did pretty much. So um, personally I wouldn't use Kingsoft right now. Um, all the Chinese antivirus vendors definitely need some more work on their software. Uh, that's it for now. I'm going to upload this video and talk to everybody later. Take care.